Hello and welcome back at Hearts of Iron 4 with our Ottoman campaign where we are fighting against one very big thing. For once, not the enemy, but mostly our own manpower issue. Will we survive long enough? Or won't we? I don't know. I really don't know. Uh, there we go, there's a supply problem. Just like a second for that, wait, wait, why don't you have a supply issue? Let's see if we can initiate the other landings from the island as well. Let's get three zones. Okay, I need to zoom in further. This Church of Islands is gonna annoy me. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's see, one, two, three. So yes, we could land in Madagascar. However, our only harbor is over there, so that's not possible. Okay, so we've got a naval base 2, naval base 4, naval base 2, naval base 2 will go into the naval area here, here, select our fleet, support fleet, uh, oh wow, this is indeed one too many, alright, so how about we do that, let's see, Oh, that's a six. That's good. Okay, um, you guys, uh, we'll go from that port to that port. You can do that one, even more of that one. And we'll move right there. There we go. So yeah, we're basically, you could call this the war against manpower. Um, against manpower? The war without manpower, I think, is more accurate. <laughs> Um, I'm not making myself easy um, with fighting with the wrong forces here, the wrong type of forces. Um, but I'm hoping... Okay, so, to get my plan to a bit more clear, I want to get this done, finished, and all that kind of stuff. But I'm not going to further use these forces. I needed to fix the big front, uh, so to speak. And when that's, you know, when that's now done, so these forces... Um, can stay behind and be used for preparations with uh, the larger invasions of the US, uh, for instance. Because um, that's where they're going to be needed for. These are strong breakthrough forces that can take a lot of ground fairly quickly. Uh, the US is also very scary because there are a lot of provinces, like a lot of provinces. And this is not even this bit, which is even more populated. Um, these guys will not be used in the island hopping, they will not be used in the, con in the, in the conquest of Brazil. Mountaineers will take out Mexico and will station themselves along the Mexican border. Then the other two divisions will just crush in here, and yeah, that's that's all we gotta work with, man. Oh, and I've got a very hot cup of tea, I'm almost burning, burning my mouth. Should not do that. That's a waste of mouth that you're burning there. Why are you doing that? Where is this accent coming from? I don't know. Indonesia is nearly out of the fight. Well, that's Netherlands, but I'm calling it Indonesia. Because it is, you know, kind of Indonesia. Um, overstacking for forces is always happening here. You know, just cut them off. Deny them a harbor. I think that will work. Alright, so you. Uh, wait, why don't you just do that for a second? Let's see if we... What, what can we do here? There's an occasional fort here, it's just very random forts just being put up by the enemy. There's some French troops there, I think I just saw a French tank. There are some Canadian tanks. Uh, is that Canada? Is that Canada? I think it's Canada. Is it Canada? Is it British Raj? It's British Raj. Could be Canada. Could be the British Raj. That looks like the British Raj though. I need to go to, if I can get Raoon here, Raoon, then use the tank to cut in here. This entire block of units is pushed in. Uh, it's cut off, I mean, and that is a good thing. Alright, you, Jet Tactical Bombers. Our close air support units are going to get removed soon. Okay, all of you, can you just see, can you get there? I'm hoping the AI just fills up the holes that I'm making. Wait, where are you from? You are Yunqun, Yunyan Free Empire. What are some of my Chinese allies? 
Okay, the AI is aggressively protecting their harbor. That's not surprising at all. That is, by the way, not sarcasm, but... Um... Okay, you guys could... Oh shit, I just deleted the wrong front. Um, there we go. And... Uh, close enough. That works for orders. Um, okay, just... You know, get rid of the... Just, you know, finish up the rest here, please. There are Mexican forces here. Wow. I was surprised with the amount of nationalities that kind of get involved eventually in this war. Not this war specifically, but in wars in general. Is this not just one nation against one nation? No, these are... Mo these are I think that's also the difference between modern warfare and a lot of uh, older types of warfare. It's that it's no longer a one nation versus another nation or a couple of a chain of allies and stuff like that. No, this is um, this is ideologies fighting against each other. And you might say, oh yeah, well you know that just makes sense because we are better than we were then. Is it? It's no longer just greed and the gain of land, no, but it's... We're not we're not no longer waging war um, due to, no, I want your land or economic reasons. O officially, I'm not gonna say that uh, there are some, might be some economic reasons to still declare war. <coughs> Oil. Um, but, I'm not bashing the US, by the way. Uh... I understand why people make the argument, but I'll keep it to that. I think there is a lot that, that the entire situation there is a lot more complicated than just either oil or you know. There's a lot of people think no, it's just because of oil. Yeah, I think there's a lot more behind it. There's a lot of political reasons, but you know, we fight because of democracy. We fight because um, other people don't agree with our statements, um, and stuff like that, and that's weird. It's you could call it. You know, we consider it freedom of speech, but is it, you know, because of what they say we don't agree with? Is it then still freedom of speech? It's a bit of moral dilemma. Just like to make people think, I'm not a pacifist. Ah, uh, which was an insult during the World War II, World War One eras. Fucking pacifists, they're ruining everything. Wait, did I once again lose one of my forces during transit? Yeah, I did. That's annoying me. That is annoying me. Should I train more? Probably not. Am I training more? Hell yeah. So a little bit of island hopping going on here. I'm gonna just set small divisions up. Uh, because I can like do f one, two, three, four, five at the same time. So perhaps six. One, two, three. Yeah, I could do six probably. Set up six invasions, ex execute them all at the same time. A big battle plan. I think most of these forces are dead. Just need to get uh, get killed. Uh, how are these guys getting any supplies? They either there's a million forces in there, or I have no clue what's happening here. There is some they have little organization at all, but there's some mechanized. They dig in. They got a good commander. The Eisenhower. William Slim. William Slim. Who's William Slim? And should I give a shit? But I just crushed Eisenhower's forces. Alright, you can set up back on, uh, on those lines. There we go. Crush them. Please. Please take care of them. Do it for me, for the, the Turks. For the glory of Turkey, or the Ottoman Empire, because we're not Turkey. 
I refuse to be a turkey. Okay. We'll use these forces to push down this final bit then. Ah, this is all crap developed. Uh, no, this is actually... Looking at this, there is decent development here. My forces might actually be useful. I just need to get past the delta here and then... Let's see, forest, 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 though. Compared to Europe, which is, I think, ah, still it's got a lot of force. Ah, Jesus, Jeremy, how many... What? Two thousand divisions! Where do you get the manpower from, my man? Okay, that attack's not a good idea. That attack is, clearly. And overrun the final bits. And there it is. A lot of, not a lot of divisions overrun. All right, stack up on this front. Your mission choose to accept it is Singapore. Ah, that's fine. Just take care of it. I accidentally reactivated my day night cycle. Uh, front line is there. Madagascar is waiting to be conquered. And then I'm going to set up some small invasions. Okay, that's one. Oh, can only create a single invasion from a given port. Okay, so I need multiple ports then. So then I want you to invade that one as well while we're at it. Uh, uh, that one. And that one. And. Hmm. Yeah, I guess that will do. There we go. Your task is still, you know, this bit here. Just push in. Sometimes, uh, this, basically they ignore um, full organizations, like, stuff like that. So these guys can organize due to issues with the, uh, when naval support available. So that's just the one, uh, the way you get through. Um, okay, one, well, three of them on this one. Three of them on that one. Three of them on that one. Three of them on this one. The rest of you should do your own stuff. That should also ease the supply problem a minor bit. Okay, we're mostly sinking convoys. I like that. That's good. Tanks are pushing in. I always like it when tanks are, you know, present. They can make the difference between a lot of things. This is all CM, right? Yeah, this is not us. Yeah, just go for the aggression. Um, some more close air support. For now, we'll, we'll switch it out once it's... Uh, Ready, we've got some naval dockyards, they can start building convoys. A lot of convoys. Um, there's still 10 of you, that's good. 88, that doesn't look right. There's... Uh, that looks fine, there's three heavy cruisers of the... How many are we building again? Can I find the right window? Yeah, I have the 15. Uh, yeah, we'll keep that. Uh, yeah, you know what? Heavy cruisers take a lot of crew. So we got three. Why don't we go about down to seven? Can you guys just slightly move faster? Madagascar, by the way, is huge. People think it's a small island near Africa. That small island is like the size of a large chunk of Europe. It is not completely in uh, uh, how it should look in EU4. 
You know, Hearts of Iron 4, as it is in the real world, but it is huge. People also forget that Africa is the largest continent in existence. This is not correct, by the way. Europe is not that big compared to Africa. I think the majority of Europe fits in like in the Sahara Desert or something along those lines. It's ridiculous the, the how huge Africa is. It's insane. Italy is making landings. Oh god, this is just perfect. People are landing everywhere. Good. I mean, that just saves me a lot of work. This is British Raj? Oh, this is England, so that needs actually to be separately invaded. Okay, so I think all forces are now invading small islands. Portuguese troops are getting sunk. How long do these travels take? 17 days, Jesus, it's about a month. Eh, I don't know, who cares. And there's one, okay, so let's stick these two towards there, let's stick this one towards there, the other one I don't really care, and that's just these two small islands and almost march my naval invasion from there to here they will move through the desert this australia now with this not having access to it just march around that's pretty damn nice so we get portugal into the axis at some point I think if they join the allies that's gonna be problematic but they will never flip anymore 60 percent the fascist coup going on Let's see, what are we sinking mostly? Convoys! I think. Convoy. 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 And a convoy. Picked up one there from Mexico. The US is not sending that many convoys anymore. How is that? US, how many thousands? That's very few, but you don't know how big those divisions are. are. It says nothing. I just wanna. I actually would prefer to see how many divisions they've got invested. So that would, you know, make more sense to me. Alright. And, oh, lucky, we can get the uh, island as well. Normally this is actually a bit of a problem due to the fact that it's an island. Alright, good. You guys have no more of any orders. That's amazing. You know, Free Empire. I think it's one of my, my vassals, is it? Let's see, they are a puppet of the new Ottoman Empire. Good. They're building forces even better. They've got to be the ones that are going to make the changes. They've got fresh forces coming out. Japan's got to be making new divisions again. Thank God for that. Okay, so this is mostly hills. Hills, hills, mountain. Okay, you guys. I have new orders. Uh, Delhi is your first strike target. And the border here is your second one. Yeah, that works. It doesn't, but it works for me now. You guys. Try to get there. Okay. Um, don't push aggressive, please. Some convoys being sunk. Naval engagement. Well, shut down. A US destroyer. How many ships do you have? More than me. Good. You've kicked them out there. There's just this little bit here that needs to be done. Naval invade your neighboring island. Thank you. Any preparations for that. This one can go. These can go. You can navally invade uh, from that little island. Come on. Come on. That little island to that little island. Thank you. You can do it from that little island to uh, that little island. Very good. Very good. And you guys can just, I don't know, stick in this. I think I should. Like a decent human being. 
just expand that harbor ASAP. Because the amount of destruction that we're going through is, is not funny. Is that island called Ascension? Oh, that's a brutal name, by the way, for an island. I live in Ascension. Like, what? It's gonna all go down, because I want the repairs to be more important. Check Tactical Bombers, one. 129 days. Check Strategical Bombers. The final button, they're done. Any naval shit? Nah, you can build all the ships you want. Alright, the final planes are also in being brought into position. Land whenever you're ready, gentlemen. These small landings are done really quick, by the way. I like it. Did we lose a couple of them? Nah, we're just intercepting some stuff. Alright, Madagascar is done. English capital is now in Ceylon. See, British capital is in Ceylon. I gotta use these six to do the invasion, by the way. And then when they're done, I'm gonna... Move in the rest, land in the bottom of India here. Work there, just land in like, I don't know, French India. There are forces here, I might actually do a proper invasion. Okay, so this island has a... how big is your port? One. Okay. You know what? You know what? Let's give it two eight one. Let's go up. Let's get you up. Get a little bit of development here. One, two, three, four. Yoink. And this is done. That means the entire army. Can assist in the invasion of Ceylon. There we go. We just set up the invasion real quick. Delete the old invasion paths. How long is this going to take you? One day. Uh, about six days. But then at least Madagascar is gone. Well, Madagascar still exists, but you know. You know what I mean. You guys make preparations. Go when you're ready. You need any more Bengal Sea access? There you go. Start working in those areas. Areas. Okay, good. Progress is being made. Uh, you guys have a way too big front. So you just go like those. And you can... Ignore that. There we go. Get some reorganization going there. You know, focus our forces a little bit better. So the big thing that still needs to happen, though, is the US. I think we are... I want to call it done. But I think we have great success here. This is just stupid. Why did you not take these provinces? Just take it. Anyway, I think we've got great success here. Uh, so... Yeah, I'm not worried, not as much anymore, but our manpower number is still going down. Um, and we are limited, and we have a couple of researches uh, and uh, tech diplomacies, uh, government laws that we can do. That might, 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 might make a bit of a difference. But I don't know how long until it's all over. You know, there is going to be a hard limit on everything we do. So this harbor is a three. I don't know what that one is, though. How big is this island in real life, Ceylon? I don't know. Just push back in. Thank you. Get the harbor. Kill the forces that are on the island. It is a big island, though. No, Italy, I don't want your expeditionary forces. Just kick out one of their fleets though. Awesome. Oh wait, that might just kill my fleet. British Raj capitulated. Awesome. Okay, you guys are going to garrison Ireland. Why Ireland? Well, Ireland's gonna be the bit that's gonna do bits. 
Okay, you guys are going for a minor naval invasion right there. And I want you guys to do a proper naval invasion from Singapore. Right, this is a crossover, so... There's still a little bit of that island hopping that I want to do. Um, and then I need a third port. This is a different naval zone, that's a bit annoying. This one works. Put that one in there. Select half of them, there we go. Now I need my navy. My navy. We sunk a couple of ships. Our destroyers are doing pretty well, actually. Um, so I don't... No. Yeah, uh... Yeah, cancel the repair task for now. I want you to... Medium repair, you're allowed to engage. I need you in those three areas active. Go when ready. Good. Let's just check a couple of reports. And yeah, success all around. We are still sinking convoys. I hope these are troop transports mostly. That would be nice. Oh, Germany invaded uh, um, Brazil. I think Germany is finally going on the attack. Good. But they have a lot of divisions. What I'm wondering right now is, what are they made of? They're weak ass. They're really weak. He's got a lot of them. Well, that works for him, I guess. Brazilian forces, where are they going? Well, uh, whatever. Not gonna pay attention to that. All right, we're running in lower, less than 30, 300,000. Blue shirt, Portugal, joint the axis. Thank God. Thank God, that just takes a load on my mind. Okay, I need to get a couple manpower loss going. So this is as strict as it gets. Yeah, 5% is the maximum here. Um, we don't longer need research time. We're not building any factories, training time, who cares? 50% output is a bit annoying. Can I, okay, can I go over for, this is training time. That doesn't really do anything for us. Um, This gives me almost surf recovery rate. Just divisions take a long time to recover. This just boosts back up again, but quite a bit. And thank you, Portugal. Training time, bit of car power gain. Okay, this gives us gets us up to a very acceptable number. Our training time is out of the wazoo, and our recovery time is also just completely garbage. So our divisions. Take a long time between attacks. Um, is that bad? Yeah, it does. It's not good. It's definitely not good. But it could be a lot worse. We are making proper progress everywhere. Who owns this? This is initially Spain. Oh, <laughs> nice. Uh, we got Ceylon though, which I'm you know, surprised that I can keep a lot of these islands. We are the island nation. Wait, you what? Oh, uh, I am seeing a problem right here, though. Now I see East Odin... Oh, is my fucking fleet sunk? Or are they repairing? Ah, uh, they need a different port, though. Um... Straits of Malacca? Java Sea, Far East and Indian Ocean, East Ocean. Uh, let's take a look at naval zones here. The Java Sea... Uh, shit, that's an extra zone actually. The fleet however is doing what? What are you doing? Okay. No. Okay, there we go. Let's 
So if I do that, okay, just let him finish that little fight there with that one destroyer. Remove. Can I please get this to work? Why is it not responding as it should? Okay, you can remove that one, but you can't remove that one. Why not? Who cares? Yeah, actually, I do. Okay, search and destroy. And these three. Can at least one of these objectives being sunk? Being sunk, that's not actually what I want So one of them is going. Good. The destroyer died. Ah, the destroyer one for the support fleet. Okay. Did I? I did lose one, didn't I? There we go. Okay, you are going... Objective, good. I think I actually need four for that landing, so I should just ignore it. Just ignore the island. I need a jumping off point here, basically. Okay, you... You just stay there for now. Um, or can I just say... That's a word. Yeah, just start working on that. That works. It takes such a long time to plan an invasion with a force that cannot, has never done it before. Kind of weird. You that way, you that way, you that way. And there's this one troop here. You can join in that one. Just get your ass over there. If you're gonna walk, by the way, I will murder you myself. Let's see, he's gonna walk the entire way, aren't you? Okay, this is first, let's get you to a harbor. Let's get you to a harbor. No. <laughs> no leaving just yet then you go right over there by ship there you go funny little man oh, they're destroying my destroyers wow I'm losing them rapidly here I'm meeting a fleet I think I might ah shit I don't want to get my Atlantic screen gone. Because they're just sinking a lot of shit uh, convoys here. Fuck me! How the hell did you get invaded there? Where are you guys? Oh, right. AI is being a moron. They're... What? That doesn't make any sense. Fuck me. Get your orders done. Land immediately. Get that done. Before they just completely stock up on forces. Maybe their factors getting sabotaged. Okay, good. Thank you. Jesus. Okay. Sometimes it's. Ugh. AIs, what do you want to do with them? Well, now they could stick like that. Okay, you have issues? Hmm. 
Invasions are being launched. You sh Wait, you guys are launching? Oh, right, this is just one sea zone. Great. Right, that's definitely not what I had in mind. Okay, the 12 of you, once you're landed, you need to take the island ASAP. Small island warfares are just annoying as hell, by the way. Okay, the 12 of you, just... Can I get that? There we go. I need to put two of you to... Over there. And then I need... Two different views. To go specifically for that point. Okay, multi-prom attacks. Go, go, go! Three more days, then you land there. Okay, so we're getting ships back in there. Good. And... No resistance here. Good. Alright, take the smallest front you can find. One province. That works. Go, 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 go! How big is this harbor, by the way? It's a one. That's not big enough. Um... Because I've got this odd sensation that a lot of other stuff's gonna go through. I want my military factories repaired as well. A lot of sabotage going on, especially in England. Well, I could just start adding on MPs to some divisions that are stationed there. Don't like the idea of that just yet. Just gotta get these roads. These are not important as much. Okay, just like that. That should be a nice, fully organized list. Jet strategical bombers. Jet tactical bombers. Okay, so you just became jet tactical bombers. Uh, jet strategic bombers. There we go. I need a lot of tanks. Well, thank God we got Portugal. It is quite literally a gift. So, check tactical bombers. Are going to need range. Uh, there we go. That's the Mark One. Just strategic bomber also is going to need range, but I don't have that much points left, so we're just going to make a slightly longer range one. Wait, this is a Mark II. Did I just done goofed? Yeah, I think I did. <laughs> Whoops. Whoops. That was not on purpose. So, Australia, do we got any forces even present? No, I don't think you do. Okay, good. Where's that one guy we are still transporting? Okay, he just came in now. Alright, you. Guys, you can go straight for... I think you can move up to there. Just go, just take it. It's yours. We're gonna get all the rubber. Which is gonna be roughly translated and we're gonna even take more uh, trade factories. Wait, this number is going up. That's not supposed to happen. The number is supposed to go down. I thought we had less than this. Ah, uh, whatever. Um, we're gonna need one, two, three, four, five. We're gonna need a lot of tungsten. We're gonna need more aluminium. There we go. How's this going? Well, it is. Let's keep it at that. Italy's also attempting its own evasions. We really should get that harbor if you want to get that evasion. Okay, so first of yours are moving in. Okay. You. Could you... Take Ireland out of the equation, thank you. Right, good. Good. 
Good, 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 good. This is still that. I'm not gonna bother with that. I will fix that after the Pacific is under Axis control. Where are you guys going? This island is not being conquered yet. Go, you, go there. You, go there. The rest of you, it's fine to go to... Uh... That's just amazing. Without even trying, we're locking down forces. Woohoo! Not for a lack of trying, of course. Just stay there, please. Thank you. I don't need 28 divisions to do that. There we go. Well, with all of them going there, I think we just can make that front a little bit bigger. Come on, guys, move it. Move your asses. When do, can I? Can you give me a guesstimation when you arrive? Six days. Right. Good. All right. So let's see. One. Two. And the three of you should be on that front as well as the twelve of you. And you go right there. Okay, awesome. That should get rid of those guys. We get rid of Australia, then there's just New Zealand need to land. I'm gonna get more of these smaller islands here. Because like France has a total of zero troops. Well that doesn't do much. England has a total of Well, 40 to 21 troops. They're stationed somewhere. Not really going to worry about that, because I think I know where they are. Oh wait, they're not there. Huh. Interesting. How did Brazil, Second Brazilian Republic... Oh, it's got a, quite a few forces. Not that much. I'm going to involve in this invasion. I wanted to, but kind of when they're now there, I don't want to, because it's got to overstack. I might just try to invade from the other side, just from here. Take uh, Hawaii and one, two, three, jump into Mexico. That might not be a bad idea. One, two, three zones. So, I'm not, okay, so I do need to do some island hopping then. Uh, let's see, one, two, three. So, it's somewhere in this zone. Also, Midway seems to be a nice something to have, as well as Jonathan at Hall. You know, a lot of the US islands might be not even a bad idea. Samoa. Tahiti. Yeah, we'll see. I think I'm gonna invade from Hawaii because it's actually well, fairly well developed. Wait, there's no harbor in Hawaii? Really? Oh wait, Hawaii is big, of course. There is a very large harbor there. Okay, need more resources. I'm gonna leave those factories, by the way, for what they are. Um, most less to do with fact that um, broken factories will be swapped out for good factories. Oh, I'm running way too long. Um, well, thank you for watching. See you guys next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.